Over a billion people around the world rely on seafood as a primary source of protein. And it's a multi-billion dollar global industry. So making sure that we have a sustainable supply of seafood is really important to livelihoods all around the, all around the globe. So EDF's goal is to make sustainable fishing the most profitable way of fishing. What it means is you have sustainable fishing, which is good for fish, and profitable fishing, which is good for fishermen. Well, the problem with the most approaches used today is that the government comes in and tries to put controls on how fishermen are going to run their businesses. Here's how many days you can be at sea. Here's how many fish you can have on your boat. You know, here's this restriction and that restriction. And the hope is that if you pile all these restrictions onto how a guy fishes, at the end of the day, when all of the guys come back, they will have caught about the right amount of fish that the scientists say they should catch. The problem with that kind of approach is that it can sometimes reach conservation targets, but even when it does, it does so at a really high cost to fishermen. It makes them fish inefficiently, it costs them money, it makes them race against each other. In the end, it makes fishing less profitable and more dangerous. An alternative approach is to get rid of all of those controls on behavior and say, here is the catch limit. Here is the number of fish that scientists say we can safely catch. And then take that catch limit and share it among fishermen, either giving shares to individual fishermen or to villages or to communities or to associations of fishermen and say, OK, you are responsible for staying within those limits. But in exchange for that, it gives fishermen the freedom to fish when they want and how they want. And that means that they are going to be able to stay within the limits, meet the conservation target, and be more profitable and have safer jobs. And we're very excited about the results that are coming in from all around the world, about the successes that fishermen are having with these kinds of systems.